the human whose name is written in this note shall die. That's absurd. This is a joke. So if I write this anchorman's name in my book, he'll die. Cool! Let's see if this works. Tonight's top story, there's a serial goat rapist on the loose. Apparently he's a... This is Light, I'm a gay. Y Yagami. Hello, Light. This is L. <laughs> That's a dumb name. <laughs> More like letter. You may have noticed a news anchor died as of late, and I'm wondering if you had any information on that. Who is this guy? And how did he know to call me after the anchor man died? Excuse me? How did I know? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Lights, I believe we may need to meet in person. What do you feel about that? Perfect. I can just make up an excuse to look at his ID, and then I'll write his name in the book. I'm sorry, Light, what book? Hey, let's meet somewhere there's a lot of people. After all, I don't know if I can trust you. No, that won't be necessary. I know where you live. I'll come to you. This is too good. No witnesses. Witnesses to what? I don't know what you're talking about. I'll see you when you get here. That went good. Ew, emo fag! So you're either socially inept, extremely rude, or both. What are you talking about? I didn't say anything. Light Yagami, can I please take a look in your room? No witnesses! Okay, let's go! So why are you here? My deductive abilities led me to believe that the newscaster's death was no accident. What makes you think that? His head spontaneously exploded. That doesn't happen. It could happen. Yes, I suppose if it was murder, it could happen. Damn, he's on to me! Light, are you admitting you could have some connection to this? What? How did he know what I was thinking? Tell me, Light, have you ever been to a therapist? <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Still, he can't figure out how I kill people. You must know that admission of guilt to me is the equivalent of confessing yourself to a police officer. Your accusations are getting pretty far-fetched. I don't know what you're talking about. Get out of my head! Life Yagami, I must know how it is you kill people. I recall clearly saying I don't know what you're talking about. There's no way he'll find out that I kill people by writing their names in the death note! Tell me what a death note is. Damn it! This has gotta be some kind of trap! No, you clearly just don't realize that you're saying aloud what you're thinking. Are you okay, Al? Cause I don't think that makes any sense at all. He'll do anything he can to convince me I'm crazy. Who is this mastermind? I'm L. I solve crimes. One's like- Like I committed? He does know I cured the anchor man by using the death note to the right of me on the TV stand. Huh. Case closed. Yeah, fucking idiot! You don't even know me, shit, it got me! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Who are you? Hello, Mr. Yagami. I am L. You're L? Yes, I've just discovered that your son's been using something called a death note to kill people. You're joking. My son would have never killed anyone. He admitted to his crimes himself. <laughs> I know this is very difficult for you, but I have to ask that I stay in your home until I can be sure that there's no further connections or clues to any of the death notes. You make accusations about my son and you expect me to open my home to you. Mr. Yagami, you're a highly respected police officer, so I know I can be sure you'll do everything you can to assist me in making sure that justice is served. Where's my goddamn son? The FBI removed light from your home moments ago. What? Please take a seat, Mr. Yagami. If what you're saying is true, then I cannot live with this shame. I will end my life! Mr. Yagami, it is your duty to assist me in this investigation. I'm also fairly certain your wife and daughter would not appreciate the task of having to clean your brain matter off the wall. <laughs> Whatever you feel you are guilty of, this is your opportunity to redeem yourself. What would you have me do? Do you have any candy? Richard Donegan's full name and time of death are written accurately. With his confession and this evidence, Light will be confined for some time. Thanks for getting rid of that kid for me. Hi. You're making this kind of awkward, I just said thanks. This is the Shinigami. So you're Shinigami. Right. He appeared right after I touched this book. I have to answer that. Oh, I have a lot of time.
Make sure you bring the book. Okay, but if I bring the book, you'll have to promise to stop ignoring me and acting borderline homosexual all the time. <laughs> <laughs> he hung up on me. That is so light. <laughs> Hello, Mesa. Light's in his room. You can go see him there. That's fine. You heard that. I didn't see that to me. Another murderer like my own son. You people make me sick. You look pretty mad. I promise I'm not some kind of light-skinned, blonde-haired, Japanese perverted fantasy come true. I'm fine. Just a rough day at work. <laughs> light! We love you long time! Oh! Hi there, Danger Stranger! I didn't realize this was gonna be a three-way, otherwise I would've brought the KY- What's going on? I'm working with Light on the Death Note. Oh! It's right here. Crap! That looks nothing like mine! What do you mean? Just look! Do you not know how to spell? Oh, is it not spelled right? It's not even close. What? That stupid shinobi! Did you just say the stupid shinobi? Yeah, silly! Light told me that... I, I have one that shows up! Shinobi are ninjas that existed in feudal Japan. What? <gasps> You ruined my son's life! Mr. Yagami, she's a fake. Take that back! How do you know? I'm real and I'll prove it by killing Mr. Yagami! If she writes my name in that book, I'm dead. This is self-defense! Relax, even if it were real, she's a litter. Misa! I have little faith in humanity already, but this is pushing it. This is becoming pathetic. You rapists! If you're trying to rape me, that's what this oh is! Oh my god, she's dumb. Damn it, where's light? I'll escort her out. Yes, that would be best. I'll write my own name down! Lisa, shut the fuck up! <laughs> Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am Ronald Donegan. As you may know, my twin brother recently died on this channel. In related news, this morning we received a tape that has instructions to be played in a few moments. I personally haven't reviewed it yet, but my producer says it's good to air, so here it is. Hello, I am Kira. Kira, as in killer. This person must be a fan of Asian culture struggling with the letter L. Or should I say, I am Kira too. The first Kira is responsible for the death of Richard Donegan. To Kira 1, I would like to request that Stop I it! You. Stop the tape! Will... Stop it! Stop the tape! This mother wants to fangirl over the guy who killed my brother? No! F*** that sh I refuse to let this continue! We are not going to... No! No! Ah! Ah! Just as I suspected, there is another notebook. Mr. Yagami. What is it, El? I want you to bring your son to me so he will remain in my custody until this case is closed. And how do you know I won't just put a bullet in his head for dishonoring me? Because, Mr. Yagami, you understand that the law is far more important than any one person's honor. <laughs> Dad, thank you for getting me out of that place. You won't regret it. I hope they raped you in prison. What? L's waiting for you inside. If you try to run, I'll consider you a threat to society and I'll put a bullet in your head. If he really means it, he would shoot his own son! Get out of my car, Light. So your dad seems pretty upset about you being a murderer. You think this is funny? I'll find the death note somewhere around here and then I'll watch him die. You're still thinking out loud, I see. L, there you go again, implying I'm verbalizing my thoughts. I assure you, you're wrong. Right now, we're trying to catch someone who's calling themselves Kira 2. So I must be here because you're not intellectually capable enough to catch him on your own. I don't need your help, Light. I just want to show the second Kira what a moron the first Kira is. <laughs> In fact, while your father was picking you up, I already tracked down the second Kira, contacted him pretending to be you, and he should be here any moment. <laughs> I wonder who that could be. Well, I don't mind helping you anyway. I just want to make sure the real cure is found. Like Yagami, your idiocy never fails to impress me. <laughs> what do you mean, El? Mm, Mr. Mikami, you can come in. God. Yes, welcome, Kira number two. I've been so eager to meet you. That's it. Just seconds away from him pulling out his death note. So I can snatch him away, write down El's name, and he'll finally die. What? Mr. Mikami, don't mind him. He's just a handicapped boy. I pay for companionship. How dare he speak to me that way? I am Kira! He's Kira. I suppose it won't hurt at this point. Yes, 
He's the one you call Kira. God! Excellent. I already have his respect. He'll have no problem in assisting me kill Al. Mr. Mikami, would you mind if I took a look at your death note? Absolutely. Any friend of Kira is a friend of mine. No! If he gets the death note, it's the end for me! Thank you, Mr. Mikami. You've been of great help to me. If he's not your friend, then why is he here? I'm screwed. I'm going back to prison. Wait, what? Mr. Mikami, I am actually L, the crime investigator. L is pretty amazing at what he does. What are you, bipolar? If he's out, we're going to prison! <laughs> I can assure you I'm not bipolar, I'm just a college student with an interest in justice. What is he, a moron? I know this! He's the idiot who handed the death note over! Speaking of which, I have the death note and a list of everyone I've contacted regarding your case. Here you go. <laughs> delete! 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 Yes! Kill them all! Delete! 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 Finally, I can become god of the new world! Delete! 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 <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment. This second now. You know, I'm very thorough when I deal with criminals like you. Why the hell is he still alive? I don't know. Not only did I switch out your death note with a fake one while you two were conversing, but I also gave you a list of fake names. You tricked me! Also, as you clearly failed to notice, I didn't supply you with a list of faces to match those names. But in your excitement, you did as I suspected you would and completely forgot that rule. <laughs> You idiot! Why did you just lock me away when you had the death note? Why humiliate me like this? Naturally, in order to achieve a solid conviction, a jury would probably require more than my word alone and his handwriting applied to a potentially coincidental time of death and name. So here we are. That's it! I'll say he's insane! I'm the son of a respected police officer, and there's two against one! See, the real reason I asked Light Yagami to accompany us today is there's actually hidden cameras all around this room. Those cameras accompanied with the two additional witnesses should be able to provide all the evidence I need in court. Officer, you can come out now. If either of you makes a move I don't like, I'm authorized to shoot to disable or kill if necessary. Also, like your father, Mr. Yagami, has been monitoring everything you've been saying in the other room. This wasn't ever about humiliating me in front of Kira 2. It was about driving the final nail in my coffin! I actually have nothing further to say to either of you. You're no longer of interest to me. Officer, can you please escort them out? All right, you two. Let's go. Checkmate, bitch! I thought I told you to shut your fucking mouth, shit! I got it! Hello, L. You're not supposed to be here. L, you know no four walls can withstand my intellect. Mr. Yagami, you don't have to bother him, L. He's dead. Killing your own father. That's quite the crime. But L, the father of a god will never kneel before him and therefore he must not exist. Light, as you may recall, you don't have the death note. I do. Damn it! Light, you're kind of zoning out right now. You will bow before me and call me Kira, and I have a death note! This doesn't make sense whatsoever. Now all I need is your name. Light Yagami, what you're doing is murder. You're not a hero, and you're most certainly not a god. Is it Luke? You are wasting our time. Leslie! Do you really think you'll guess my name? Leon Lionel Lucifer! How ironic you mentioned Lucifer, considering it means bringer of light. Just tell me your name! Shinigami, make the deal! If I give you the Shinigami eyes, I'll cut your lifespan in half. You know how it works, you idiot! Whatever, take it! Oh! Initiated. You just erased all the information you had on me. You just made this so much easier. I suppose it doesn't hurt to tell you, so the end game protocol transmits all information on active investigations to the FBI. <gasps> really, if you think about it in this context, the main purpose of the end game protocol is to hasten the sentencing of your death penalty. <laughs> Light Yagami, you're zoning out again. Your name is Laliette! Huh. I suppose that means you have me defeated. I suppose I do. Face how stupid you are, right? You know, Shinigami, it's over. You can finally shut the fuck up. Yeah, actually... Ryu, there's really no need to worry. Everything's fine. Fine, don't let him make himself look like an ass again. What's the matter, El? You can't come up with any insightful last words? Uh. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I finally did it, Shinigami! <laughs> I look down, you have... Uh... Huh? Oh, no, that, no, that's just a banana, see? Jesus Christ. I like to store them in my pants just in case I get hungry. They're still a bum bitch that's much smaller. Shut up, Shinigami, you're ruining this for me! You're not so stupid you think he's actually dead, right? What? He's faking it. That's impossible! 
lie to Aki means very important for you to realize you're currently in a padded cell. But I escaped! You're an idiot! Idiots don't escape anything but reality! I want you to understand something, Light. In no reality, even your imagination, can you defeat L. Yes, but even the imagination has rules. You would be dead because I saw your face and name! Not if you don't know what his original face looks like. What?! Light Yagami, what you did not suspect is that long ago I underwent facial reconstruction surgery, which serves as good as a mask. And considering all photographs prior to the accident have been destroyed, there's no real possible way you could kill me with the death note. What?! I gave you the Shinigami eyes like a moron. You ignore the fact that when you wrote down his name in the death note, his lifespan didn't change. This can't be happening! This is a joke! Just write your own name in the book over here! You shut your goddamn mouth, Shinigami! It's as I said, you can't win. <laughs> It's time to return to the <laughs> Hello? Lolliet. I'm going to be paying you a visit very soon. Bye bye. Knowing Mello, he is no doubt on his way to kill me so he can claim my title and death note. However, now he can only succeed by physically ending my life. <laughs> This is L. I think it's time for you to vacate Light Yagami's residence. Near, I suspect I'll be fine. I've been tracking Mello, and he's within a mile of your location at this very moment. I do not run from crime, I solve it. You can't solve anything if you're dead. The building I'm in is secure. I suppose there's no harm in us working together. I've already briefed Light's father on where to take you. He's waiting outside. Yes, goodbye. Near, I brought L to you as instructed. Thank you, Mr. Yagami. Your assistance is greatly appreciated. Whatever I can do to compensate the mistakes of my son. Near, Mello barely missed you. I should have called sooner. I was slow. I had the impression Mr. Yagami could handle Mello, but your alternative offered less risk. I thought exactly the same thing. That was fast. He's clearly thirsty. I suppose this was pointless. In this case, confrontation was inevitable. I'll go talk to him. He wants you dead, not me. I'll cover you. Near. You need to leave. I don't respond well to orders. You can leave on your feet or in a body bag. It's your choice. I don't respond well to threats either. Hello, Mr. Yagami. Nice to meet you. And to think you used to stand for something. L knows what I want. Go ahead and take it, Mello. L, I want more than the death note. Do you sincerely believe the book is even real? You're always acting like you're better. Do you really think you're smarter than me? You're the one with the gun. What does it matter what I think? You're pathetic. And you're next, so keep it up. L. What did you write? <laughs> L. Piece of cake. If this works, we'll die. L wouldn't make this mistake. In just a few more seconds, you'll be nothing more than lifeless corpses. In my calculation, the only death that is more than probable is yours. That's not how I see it. I know all of your real names, and I know what your face looked like before the surgery, L. Which means you're already as good as dead. You did write all our names. L, what have you done? You really think you have what it takes to be the next L? How did he even know? You've always lusted after power. You regularly want to be the best, and in your own twisted way, you too believe in justice. Defeating crime does not require ambition alone. It also calls for a superior intellect that which you do not seem to possess. I do what it takes, which makes me better than both of you. Then why aren't we dead yet? <laughs> you gave me a fake. Mello, flip to the end. You've written all of your names misspelled four times each. According to the rules of the Death Note, this renders it completely powerless against us. But that means you broke a rule and you should be dead. If a Death Note owner accidentally misspells a name four times, that person will be free from being killed by the Death Note. However, if they intentionally misspelled the name four times, the Death Note owner will die. This is exactly why I offered Misa a reduced sentence if she attempted to spell each of our names four times in the Death Note. Misa is an illiterate idiot. You know... 
Precisely. Just to be certain of our safety, I made sure that I pronounced each of our names incorrectly. She offered up an honest attempt at spelling our names each time and failed exactly as I expected. She consistently expressed ignorance to the rules of the Death Note and the Shinigami eyes themselves. Every move I made was calculated. Fuck yeah! You have only a few options now. You could try to run or even kill us, but we both know that Mr. Yagami is a trained sniper. You also have the option of surrendering and going to prison for attempted murder. Or you could retain what little honor you have left and write your own name in the book. You are the true L. Let's get back to work. That was fucking epic! I'm gonna have my team recover Mello's body. No need to bother. He's already gone. What? L? Nate, I imagine what really just happened is sinking in your mind right this instant. Mello. How did we miss that? What's going on? Well, Mr. Yagami, after Mello realized it was impossible to kill the three of us using the Death Note, he wrote down his own name, Mihail Kiel, to do what we assumed was accept his defeat. I know this. He wrote down someone else's name, a name he shares. But his name is right here. I checked the spelling and the rules to make sure he was dead. No, Mr. Yagami. If someone shares the same name as you, is their name theirs, or is their name yours? <sighs> He murdered someone who shared his name? Exactly. He just visualized the face of the person who shared his name as he wrote. It likely only took him a few minutes to find them online. Where is he? He also likely took a piece of the Death Note with him. This is precisely why he was chosen as a successor of mine. He outsmarted us all. Hey, what took you so long? I got what I needed. Good to know. As soon as you stop playing with your phone, we can end this. Just wait a sec, I'm about to beat my game. Fine, I'll stop. You creep me out when you're all quiet. And? And I think it's about time I take care of everything myself. Hey, Matt. You make me proud. If he outsmarted us before, what else are we missing? If I knew, it would have been optimal for me to say it by now, don't you think? Yes! How are we at a dead end? Are you implying our lives are in danger? Most certainly someone's life is. Based on what? Based on the fact that there's a page ripped out of the Death Note. Most anyone could die for almost any reason at this point, and it would be completely untraceable to Mello. But all he wants is your head, L. Why- There's someone outside. You did call for backup, Mr. Yagami? You told me to an hour ago, and I did exactly that. And when you called, how far away were they? No more than 15 minutes. What? After brief consideration, I've concluded that we have about a 20% chance of surviving the next few minutes. Where did you come up with that? Well, the Death Note is likely involved. That's Mile. If that is Mile, our chances of survival just dropped to 3%. He has a gun, I'm taking him out. Mr. Yagami, every shot will miss. Nonsense. It appears Mello wrote down Mile Javas's name on the Death Note page. Why would Mello do that to Mile? He did it to ensure we would all die, leaving few enemies of his remaining to identify him as L. We're wasting our time, we need to think of a defense- The Death Note specifies that if one's end could be carried out in the way described, then it will be so. We're really going to die. You should know, death is the end of a chapter, not the entire book. Holy shit!
This is amazing. <laughs> Miles Yvonne will acquire a gun to hunt down Elwa Leet, Nate River, and Sochiro Yagami. Upon encountering each person, he will without hesitation fatally wound them. He will then immediately take his own life. <laughs> so much drama. <laughs> Why am I still alive? I thought the death note rule stated another could be forced to. Both Mello and Matt are dead. What did I miss? We all survived. The bullet didn't damage my internal organs. How? What is the explanation for our survival? Death Note reads whether the cause of the individual's death is either a suicide or accident. If the death leads to the death of more than the intended, the person will simply die of a heart attack. This is to ensure the other lives are not influenced. So this is why we did not die. Light Yagami has influenced unrelated parties with the actions of whoever subjected to the Death Note, so people can be influenced. However, our survival was not luck. It was a precise surgical calculation. And now the only enemy who knows my original face is dead. We've prevailed.